Point based nonprofit organization has one main goal, and that's to get kids reading. So for seven years now, Books for Birthdays Incorporated has been able to help many children foster a love for books. And that's thanks to our next live guest. Oh, and joining us now is Mrs. Jeanette Dickens. We're so glad to have her here. She is the president and founder of Books for Birthdays. Good morning, Jeanette. Good morning. Thank you for having me. You are so welcome. So what inspired you to start this whole program? My uh, mother always encouraged us when I was young to go to our neighborhood library and read books during the summer. And I was always fascinated with the characters and the settings and the places that I read about. And that love of reading continued with me as I grew up. And by the time I got married, my husband is was a pastor and he started um, we started a children's library and also a summer reading program and to get children interested in love of learning and that's kind of what got me into it wow and what have you noticed you and your husband um since you started this organization what has the community impact been like well the social workers who deal with the children always tell us when I talk to some of them that the children are anxious to get their birthday books uh, when the year comes around for their birthdays. So I'm, and they all, sometimes they write notes and let us know how they've enjoyed their book. And I think it's uh, interesting that one child, when I delivered the book, was in a lobby with his mother and he could not stand still. He wanted to get my books out of the <laughs> container. <laughs> Oh, that's really sweet. Jeanette, it sounds like there is a need for a lot of right. books for this program. So how can the community get involved in the effort? Well, we have a um, Facebook page and also a website and they can uh, check on the page and we can get donations through PayPal or through our Amazon wish list that's on Amazon. And we can also receive a uh, monetary donation or book donations at our address, Books for Birthdays, Inc. at 1589 Ski Club Road, a Suite 102 at High Point, North Carolina. Jenna, can you speak more about just the meaning of Books for Birthdays? These are children in the foster care system that may or may not have a lot of books, you know, where they are exactly. living. And so is this on their special day, on their birthday, they're able to get these books donated totally for free. And is that why you wanted them to feel special on their special day? Exactly. Uh, we do not take any used books because it is a birthday present. So we want the children to feel special. And so the workers usually uh, inform us of any special request of books that they are asking about. And so we try to match the book with the child's request and they're all purchased new and we instill and, and, and or put a sticker in each book with the child's name on it. And therefore, if they are moved to another home or if they return to their homes, they can take their own books with them. Oh, that's really sweet. Jeanette, how, how many would you say um, children are you are you serving with your program? Currently, I'm not sure that number fluctuates so often, but uh, we do not have an uh, up-to-date count of how many children. Each month we get a list of the children's names and their ages, and then we just supply the books. But we have, like I said, contributed right now 3,500 books uh, to the program. Wow, that's a lot of books. And yeah. if people are looking for ways to help out during the holiday, I mean, what a yes. perfect time, right? To to get some new books when they're out doing their holiday shopping mm -hmm. and put exactly. them to good use for books for birthdays. Jeanette, thank you for your time and all of the work you are doing for our children in foster care. And for those of you at home watching, wanting to help out, you can head to booksforbirthdaysinc.org. The website's on your screen. And also keep your eyes peeled. You can take out your mobile device you can scan this QR code you see that will give you access to their book wish list then you can send a book straight to the organization directly to help out that's really cool and she also mentioned too the address of the organization 1589 Skeet Club Road Suite 102 in High Point so how did you memorize you that 